Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be doing a Divine Masculine to a Divine Feminine reading today. And I um, want to get right into the message and see what Source wants you to know. I thank you guys for returning back to my channel, old and new. I appreciate all your love and your support. I thank you for all your likes, shares, comments, and subscribes to my channel. And um, without further ado, I want to jump on right on in the message and see what Spirit wants you to know about Divine Masculine to Divine Feminine, okay? Let's see what Source needs you to know. I do ask that Archangel Michael come in and protect me as I channel through the messages, giving me clear and concise messages for I and the Collective. And then no harm come to I and the Collective in any kind of way. Thank you, Spirit. And we're just going to get right into it right now and see what's going on. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, ancestors. Thank you, Spirit Gods. All right. What messages, Spirit, do you want me to share with the divine feminines to the, from divine masculine? What is the message that I need to share with the divine feminines to the divine, from divine masculine? The collective. What's going on, Spirit? Show me what I need to see. Give me some messages, please. And thank you. What's going on with the spirit? What's going on with the collective? What's going on with divine masculine? To divine feminine. Thank you. Holy Spirit, my sisters and God, show me what to see. What's the message? What's going on with divine masculine? I said, what do you need to release? Okay, and it's time to take action. Spirit is putting in um, your divine masculine's um, energy is letting him know that it's something that he has to release, something that he has to move away from. Something's going on with divine masculine's energy right now is keeping him in a in a point where he really needed to take action. Really need to dig in deep up here in his heart space and see what's going on in his heart space right now and move. It's time to take action, Spirit says, from Divine Masculine. Divine Masculine has to take action right now. And he's trying to gather up the strength to take action out here. Okay? It's something he has to release, though. It's something he knows he has to release. So... Okay, what's going on with Divine Masculine Spirit Cards? Give me some more cards, please. Give me some more messages. Is there anything else that I need to share with the collective Divine Feminist from Divine Masculine? Ancestor Spirit Guides, show me what I need to see. Show me what I need to see. Communication is key. He has to open up. Communication is key right now for Divine Masculine. He has to open up right now. That's what's keeping this relationship from going forward. His throat chakra has to be open and activated right now. Okay, let's move forward. What else, Spirit? What's going on, Divine Masculine to Divine Feminine? What's going on? What is the messages? Give me some mes messages, please, Spirit. Ancestors and God, show me what I need to see. Please and thank you. Yeah, your Divine Masculine is up where he, he's stressing right now. On how to come towards you and make this offer. He's up in his, he's in his head right now. Here in his head, worried up at night, all through the night, stressing on how to come towards you. Mm. Yeah, he knows that's competition now. He's he knows that's others fighting for your attention. He knows that's others fighting for your um, affection. He also has to fight off friends and family. Because they, they gave him the wrong advice. Now he's understanding what happened in this relationship and what caused the the, the fallout. I hear fallout, the um, misunderstanding. Okay. What else, spirit guides? Yeah. So right now he's he's up in his head, like again, back and forth in his head, um, trying to figure out how can he come in, how can he come towards you, how can he make this move towards you. Yeah, that's what I hear. What else, spirit guys? What else I need to tell the divine masculine? The divine feminine from the divine masculine. Please and thank you. 
Anything else? Anything else, spirit guides? What else? What else do I need to share? Yeah, he's ready to come in. Celebration. He wants to celebrate. He wants to celebrate with you, divine feminine. Yeah, he wants to celebrate. The Three of Cups energy here. He wants to reconcile. I hear celebration. Celebration time. Yeah, he wants to do right by you. He wants to come in and show you the fairness. Show you. He wants to do right by you. Is what I heard the first time. He wants something to turn around, and he wants you to see him in another different, a different light. I heard he wasn't showing you, showing you his true, authentic self at the time. He held back, but he doesn't want to hold back any longer. He, he's ready to come in, come towards you, and he hopes to see a future with you. On the bottom of the deck, I have the two of wands, which is planning to come towards you again with the justice card. Okay, what else, here? Anything else from Divine Masculine to Divine Feminine? What's going on with Divine Masculine's energy? What's going on? Holy Spirit, thank you. Yeah, he's recuperating. He could be possibly um, re-recuperating again here. Um, he's resting. He is trying. Again, I, I hear um, really, really going in with him to get some answers right now from Spirit. Because he really wants to, um, he wants to reconcile with you. He wants to, he wants to put to rest the things that has caused this breakup to, to come between you guys. Um, he wants to fix things. Simple as that. He wants to fix things with you, Divine Feminine. He wants to come in and, sh and celebrate. He wants to do right by you. Um, the things that, um held him back from doing right by you he's putting that behind him which could be which could have been friends and family and things that came between you guys um once more i just feel like he just really want to show you his true self he held back his true self from you he didn't show you his authentic self because he was too busy thinking about what other people thought about him but he understands now other people's thoughts about him and actions is not gonna give him Peace, not gonna give him peace within, and that's what he lacked peace within. But when he was with you, he had peace. He had peace with you. You, you were true to him through it all. You stay true to yourself, and you didn't change. You stay true to yourself. So right now he's he was he's reflecting what you did, and now he want to do the same thing. He wants that same kind of feeling that he had with when he was with you. He knew how you did things. He seen the reflection of what you went through and kept going, you know, steady. Didn't give up, didn't stop. You didn't change. I heard you didn't change and you were steady. And you know, he know you wanted the same thing with him. You received the same kind of energy, but yeah. I heard he went through some things that caused him to feel like he couldn't he couldn't do his his true self with nobody else because he was hurt in the past. He was hurt in the past from someone that he really cared about and opened up himself to and they only let him down and he went down from here from there okay let's see what else we want you to know yeah he missed your energy he what he missed your authentic energy your support you gave was very authentic and he knows that you were true he knows that you were true he's seeing it seeing things differently now yeah, with the hangman. He's saying things for what it is. Yeah, I hear he's saying things for what it is. That's the truth. Yeah, with the hot priestess. He knows exactly what it is. <laughs> His intuition tells him so. That's what's going on with Divine Masculine. He, the, his intuition is really kicking in. I hear his intuition is really kicking in. Thank you, Spirit. Let's get some clarifications. Let's get some clarifiers. Holy Spirit, ancestors, and gods. Yeah, he's ready to come towards you. Right out. Three of Wands. Planning to come in. Planning to come towards you. He's 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 waiting for his ships to come in. To come in towards you. To come towards you. I hear he's coming in. He's coming towards you. Looking um, and planning. Seeing the bigger picture. Having the confidence that what he has put out into the universe. He's attracting it back in. And what he desired, he's going to have it. And he wants you to mind him. And he feels like it's going to be successful if he just get moving. 
the strength but right now he's um could be possibly waiting on something um else to happen to get make that first move or you give him a sign perhaps something to show or he's waiting for a sign so that he can make that move but yeah he's planning he got it in his heart space in his mind space that you the one with the ace of cups you're the one ace of cups energy on the bottom of the deck he's in love with you divine feminine divine masculine is in very much in love with divine feminine right now okay that's the energy he is embodying right now for you with unconditional love also on the bottom of the deck queen of cups energy and he loves the energy that you embody and this is what he wants to come back to queen of cups he sees you as the queen of cups mm -hmm. very intuitive very giving very loving very compassionate self-caring he, he wants he hopes as well that you will be receiving and receptive as you were when you were when you um were together because this is what he loves most about you okay that loving and caring nurturing energy that you give off okay as well as you know you're the empress all right you you're the empress he wants and hopes that you're still the queen of cups energy very loving and kind and forgiving okay and compassionate towards him when he comes back in and give you his ace of cups this this ultimate offer i right hear ultimate offer right here this is the ultimate offer right here that he have for you ace of cups energy he loves you very much in love with you okay yeah he's walking away from something so he's releasing something right now he could possibly be leaving something that was very um long or very it, it, he held on to something for a long time okay and now he's finally walking away from it with the ace of cups or he knows that you're walking into your okay whatever it is he this is what divine masculine is feeling for divine feminine okay he wants to come towards you with the eight of cups walking away from something to come towards you to his emotional wish fulfillment is to come towards you yeah and start um, a new cycle with the world court on the bottom okay um this is what he desires to have a new cycle with you you have to excuse my nails i have to get my nails done <laughs> but um all in good timing of course but yeah this is what it is that he desires a new start a new cycle with you divine feminine with the world part okay yeah but he feels that you also have your guards up you have um set up strong boundaries he knows that so he knows that he is going to have to come in with all upright and integrity of a part because he knows you're protected with the seven of wands divine family you are very very protected spirit is protecting you from anything and everything if it's not time it won't happen but when it's time spirit is going to cause that you know door to be open for you guys to have that union to have that that um reset to start over a, a new cycle again but it has to be in good intentions and good heart space because spirit is not going to let divine masculine come towards you divine feminine if divine masculine's heart is not right so but i feel divine masculine's heart is right and spirit is opening that door and spirit is also protecting this relationship this union okay that's what i feel here all right let's move forward let's see what else we want you to know let's get some more clarification here all right what spirit is what is going on spirit ancestors and guides What's the messages that I need to see? I see something. Oh, that part is not even supposed to be in here. This is the whole another deck. Okay, what is this? Yeah. He sees you as a woman holding the heart. Okay, this is the unconditional love he feels for you as well with the woman holding the heart. Okay. This is the, env the embodiment of his energy, you know. Um, energy is energy, feminine, masculine, but this is what he's embodying right now for you. And he, he, he desires for that energy to be reciprocated. If he comes back towards you, is you going to receive him? Is you going to accept him? Or are you going to open your arms to him? Or are you going to reject him? That's what I hear. Because he is really, truly wanting to come towards you. He regrets not opening up to you. Okay. I hear he regrets not open up up to you because you gave him no reason at all not to open up to you and he realizes that now that all you did was be loving all you did was try to show him how to love want to be loved true love because 
really what it comes down to it you were the only one that was genuine to him in his life like since he's known anyone i hear you are the one that was truly genuine the whole time the whole time okay and he knew that you had to leave you had to do what is best for you and um he know you love him he knows that you're in love with him but he know you have to do what you have to do to take care of you and he respect that he respect that about you about feminine he respect that you you went on to further yourself and loving yourself self-care you know respecting yourself and, and doing good you know within your heart space you did what's best for you he respects that okay and, and that's why he's coming back towards you there's no one else like you there's no one else like you divine feminine he realizes that now with the hangman he realizes that you were the best thing that ever came in, into his life i mean i mean you're the best thing that ever happened to him okay the best thing that ever happened what else for it any messages yeah he, he sees you as the sun the sun part here this is the enlightenment that he feels with you you bring so much enlightenment to his life okay divine feminine this is what he feels for you the sun best card of the deck best card of the deck in tarot happiest part in the deck the sun this is your person y'all are meant to be in this lifetime in the 3d okay i feel like this is a spiritual union a spiritual relationship okay with the queen of cups coming out on each part like this one two queen of cups energy here with the ace of yes this is a spiritual connection i feel okay so this is what's guiding you guys back together because this is really this is genuine this is this is genuine okay patience here this is spirit working it out for you guys working through you guys are working things out in the spirit world in the spirit realm and spirit is helping you okay spirit is helping you guys and change will happen in this right time patience is needed yeah five of earth coming out of the cold again another five change is coming change is here eight ten so a cycle has been completed a cycle has ended a cycle karmic cycle has ended and a new cycle will begin change will happen yep with the eight of pentacles you guys will come back together and work on this relationship things will happen for you guys in this lifetime Things will happen. It will happen. I hear it will happen. Anything else, Spirit? Anything else? Holy Spirit, ancestors, and God, show me. What is the message that I need to share with divine feminine to from divine masculine? What's the message, you Holy Spirit? Please and thank you. Show me what I need to see. Show me. Thank you. Yeah, I ate a water. Walking away from something again. Divine masculine is walking towards you. Or walking away from something, releasing something, and he's coming towards you with the eight of cups or with the eight of water. That's two eights. That's three eights on the board. Four eights, okay? Because the eight of cups came on the um, other tarot deck. From the other tarot deck. And here it is again, eight of water. This which is the eight of cups. Okay? Spirit is talking. Spirit is talking. Something's about to happen. Something is about to happen. I haven't seen the tower yet, but I feel it. Something is about to happen. What's going to happen, Spirit? What's coming in? What's happening for divine masculine to divine feminine? What's coming in? What's the energies? Show me what they can see. Show me. Message of fire. A message is coming in. Page of wands. This is the page of wands. Well, this is a message of fire, okay? Which is the page of one's energy in a regular tarot deck. This is, yeah. Um, get ready for a message to come toward, uh, come in, all right? Expect the message. Yeah, possibly from an earth sign. Message of, of earth. Yeah, on the bottom of the deck, message of earth. So, yeah, expect a message to come in. Expect someone to to come towards you expect your divine masculine to come towards you all right that's what i hear 
because he's walking away from something to come towards you. And I hear it plain as day. He's coming towards you with hope and great faith that you're going to take him back. <laughs> take him back in with loving arms. Yeah. Because you are his wish fulfillment. On the bottom of the deck, not, not the water. You are bo both each other. You both. You are both one another's wish fulfillment. You are both each other's wish fulfillment. You fulfill him, you for, and they fulfill you. You are each other's wish fulfillment, and he is coming back for his nine of cups. Okay, let's get some more messages and spirit. Ancestor spirit, guys, what's going on? What's the divine masculine? What's the message that I need to share? Yeah, he's been a, a great, a great um, feeling of guilt and sabotage here in his. Um, Mental space, I feel, um, feeling guilt and, excuse me, guilt and sabotage. You say sabotage on the bottom of the deck. I don't know if you can see that, excuse me. But your divine masculine is feeling such a remorse of guilt, a five of cups energy, how he feel. Because of what happened, he, 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 I feel he is really sincere and hoping for another chance with you divine feminine and spirit says this will happen but all in good timing yeah all in good timing it will happen be patient patience is here is needed okay what else spirit anything else anything else from divine masculine divine feminine yeah something happened in the spring all right seeds were planted in the spring okay so whatever happened with you guys something that was causing um in march april between march and april spring okay all right seeds were planted those seeds were planted or seeds are it will grow and so it's getting time it's ready it's getting time to harvest right now so i say october next month expect some um, expect something something to happen okay expect change expect expect a message expect um something from your divine masculine divine feminine because this is what's coming in this is what i feel here this is what i sense in my spirit this is what i feel from spirit as, as my spirit gods are showing me yeah a new cycle completion it's going to start something new i feel in the month of october between october and november you're going to expect a harvest to expect something that was planted from um in the springtime to come to harvest all right a new cycle is going to it's going to come in with the cycles change and completion here you expect the change again you can, i don't know if you can see that but right here in the middle it says change all right right there it says change okay cycles completion all right that's what i see here all right, you guys, that's what I have for you. I hope you got something out of the message. And then, you know, let me know in the comments if this resonated with you, um, Divine Feminist, um, from, your, from your Divine Masculine. Um, but in any case, I say this. Expect change. Expect new things to happen because new beginnings are on its way. It's sometime around, like I said, in October or November, a big change is happening. I... I a big change is coming. A big change is what I hear. It's because something big is happening. Okay? It's coming. So get ready for it. All right? All right, guys. Thank you.